welcome guys so this video <coughs> uh, we <coughs> we try to prove this thing so phase uh, n by n complex matrix and uh, we want to prove that the uh, nipotent uh, if and only if all the eigenvalues are zeros okay so uh, the nipotent means that uh, there exists some n uh, uh, some k such as uh, a to the k zero <coughs> okay so we prove first uh, directions. So now uh, eigenvector means that ax is equal to lambda x, and that is lambda means the eigenvalue. So we can take the k, and it's very easy. We know that this is this, and I think ak is zero for some k. So tell you that uh, there is just some k such that uh, lambda k is zero for all lambda. So tell you that uh, lambda is zero. Okay, so yeah, so this way we have proof. Okay. And the second way, uh, all the eigenvalues are zeros. Uh, we need to use a theorem called the Schur's uh, decomposition. Basically, if A is uh, n by n complex matrices, uh, the important part is this complex. Yeah. So uh, I will tell you something others. So if A is complex matrix. Uh, then uh, uh, it can be written as uh, U T U inverse. This T is the upper triangular matrix, and the, the eigen and the, the diagonal part is the eigenvalue. Yeah, so these are all zeros. Okay. Uh, so suppose your all the eigenvalues are zeros. That means zero, zero, zero. So I tell you that A is just U times zero, zero. Zero. Okay. So since your your uh your a in some basis is already zeros at uh, all the uh, all the entries, right? So you can show that uh, it's obviously that uh, if you a to the case power, uh, when you uh, uh I should say when you do the nth power, and uh, you will see that that is zero, will start to uh, propagate here. So for example, uh, if you use do this, uh, if you square, then you will get the zero, 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 something. And if you do a cube, then it will be zero. So that means this must have n to the a n will be zero. Okay, because this is the matrix uh, which all the eigenvalues, uh, all the diagonal are zero, so if you do the a n power is zero. Okay, uh, you can just, so this is a small example, a supervisory matrix. You see, this is the eigenvalue, the diagonal is zero, and uh, if you let A, B, C square, then you get something here, and then you can keep square and it becomes zero. Okay, so which shows that uh, is important. Okay. Uh, why complex import? Uh, why complex is important is that if you have, uh, re if you restrict into a real, then there's no such kind of de uh, decomposition. So basically, you can construct a maybe like this, right? and then you can check that a is important. Uh, a, uh oh, sorry, a is. Uh, uh, a uh, all uh, uh, a is important, right? But the eigenvalue is, is is not because uh, because uh, you are not allowed lambda to be uh, complex. Uh, yeah. So this is the key also. Uh, yeah, the key point is that you are not allow you are not allow lambda to be complex. So there's no uh no decomposition that you can use okay so that's it and uh, I will see you guys in the next videos